Okay, Aquarius, I'm drawn to this deck. And uh, this is one of the Archangel decks. So, show me the cards that we need to see for Aquarius Spirit. Okay, okay. They're not going to be throwing them. I'm going to be cutting the deck. And then we'll get our message. Okay. Ace of Michael. Ooh, mercy. Look at that. That's wonderful. A wonderful new idea. Don't allow bumps in the road to hinder your progress. Clear up communication problems with others. And, you know, if you're messaging back and forth, that's not a good idea. That, that gets everything all messed up. You know, it's much better if you can talk in person. Yeah. Um, especially if you, even if you can see the person and talk to them. Oh my goodness, twenty new beginnings. Oh, look at that. That is awesome. Starting a new life, finding your purpose, a forgiving and compassionate review of the past. So, being able to look back and forgive and go forward in peace. Oh my goodness. Could you ask? I mean, that's awesome. Four of Raphael. Seek out other possibilities. Look for the magic in life. Be aware of your own emotions. You know, maybe do some of um, meditations around healing the inner child. You know, maybe seek out um, and think about your inner child. You know, you. <laughs> yeah. Four of Ariel. Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. Look at it. When you give, you also receive. Being resistant to change extremes in how you save and spend money. So, you do need to watch how you go about um, spending and saving money. Yeah. So this tells me that if you have been putting yourself out there and putting your work out there or whatever, uh, you're going to get back. Um, you know, and when you do spend money, expect to get it back. You know, you can watch how you spend. So if you're an over spender, maybe you need to watch that. But if you save too much and you don't spend it all, maybe you need to watch that. Um, either way, when you spend, expect to get it back. Don't, don't feel like you're not going to, it feels like. 11, strength. Look how beautiful. Strength and grace through kindness, self-confidence, and forgiveness. So, you're, there's going to be a moment, that's Archangel Ariel, where... You need that strength. Someone's going to push your buttons. They are going to push your buttons. Look here. Your material needs are going to get fulfilled. But first I'm drawn to the top. Yeah. See. See. It's taking me back. Up here. You know. Don't allow the ba the past. Um, it feels like. You know. Clear communication. If you had some unclear communication in the past, it's going to hold you back. You see what I'm saying? This right here. Release the past. You will grow from this situation. Time heals all wounds. I feel like that, you know, you're going to have to have strength. And it has to do with something from the past. It's got that feeling to it. But in the overall, yeah. Then we jump down here because I was so drawn to it. Six of Ariel. Material needs get fulfilled in magical and unexpected ways. Acts of kindness, giving and receiving with a grateful heart. So you will receive as though you give. And then I was drawn to four of Gabriel. Time for a celebration. Abundant rewards for hard work. Release yourself from burden, burdensome situations. So let go of what is hindering you. So what what within you is hindering you? Because I feel like that's that's where this is. You know, it's it's almost a feeling like, okay, if if it's other people hindering you, think about what's for your highest good. If the, if 
they're not for your high skin, you may have to cut them out of your out of your life. Now, um, situations, you know, and other things. If it's not for your highest good, do you really need it? You know what I'm saying? But if it's also thoughts within you or things that's going on within you, if it's not for your highest good, do you need to have those thoughts or do you need to have those uh, tendencies or those habits or those negative behaviors that's causing you to feel in a way that you don't need to? Think about your highest good. Yeah, that's what this feels like. So that's what I've got for you. This is good. It looks really good. And thank you so much for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. I truly do. Thank you for everyone who, you know, just watches or um, everyone who participates in some way, whether it is um, subscribing or, or following or a thumbs up or a heart or, you know, to those who um, give, you know, Whatever it may be, I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you so much. Till next time. Bye.